Hey, what's going on, everybody? Low mid 70s uh, in the daytime, low to mid 40s at night. Pretty big temp jump um, last couple of weeks. The uh, the zoo of multiplying onions just doing their thing. Looks like they're doing pretty well with the cooler weather and uh, getting transplanted out into their own pods. This is week four of the radishes. Looks like all except for one. I guess there's a tiny one, but looks like the leaves are pulled off. Missing three here. And one or two here. So overall, not bad germination rates. Um, these are the French breakfast radish. These are supposed to be a little bit quicker than the other ones. They're supposed to be like four week, but I would guess based on the colder weather, probably two more weeks before I'm picking these. Again, these are the white hailstone, and these are the watermelon. So, no real sign of anything going on here right now. Um, other than that, things are going slow, but the potatoes are doing really well. So is that weed. I haven't uh, gotten around to pulling it out. The donor bean plant's actually starting to climb up the, uh, the trellis. So that's kind of funny. And this other one hasn't quite gotten that far, but I'm just leaving them to see what they do. I should at some point dig one of these horseradish out and see what they look like. They've been here um, most of the year now, so it'll be fairly interesting to see what uh, what they turn into. I probably need to transplant this lemon. This was that very first cutting that I did off of that tree when I first got it. And then I left it inside for a very long time, so it was pretty runty. And then now that it's uh, transplanted out, it's actually doing really well. Probably needs to go in a five gallon bucket. Nothing else real crazy going on in the backyard. Oh, there is one thing. All right, there is a couple of cool things. So the lemon and the limes, they are blossoming. This one, a little bit this one a lot. Ah, good to see bees buzzing around. That's always good in this day and age, right? The sweet potato is taking its sweet, uh, sweet time, but uh, not doing bad. The newer one, lots of green leaves, but we'll see if it handles the cooler winter weather. Blackberries, no berries. Unless something uh, crept up when I wasn't looking. I mean, the plants are healthy. But, you know, first year plants, what do you expect? So the surprising thing, as I found out as I was walking around the other day, is we've got a couple of raspberries popping up. They're not huge, they're not tiny, they just, you know, I guess we'll call it normal size. So, I did get a little bit of fruit off of it, not a lot, but hey, you know, some is better than none. So, we'll see what ends up finishing uh, growing and ripening, but, you know, there's a few berries to, uh, to pick and eat, as long as I get them before the birds do. Um... These three blueberry plants, I think they're dead. I've been watering them. This one's got a little green. That's not that, that's weeds. It's got a little bit of green, so we'll see what happens, but I'm guessing they're dead, so. Kinda sucks, that's five or six bucks a piece, but uh, you know, at the temperature I bought them, it was hit or miss anyways. Um, the only other thing that's interesting just a lot 
limes. I actually need to pick a lime. This one's kind of turning color, which is kind of weird for the lime, but you'd think it was a lemon, right? Anyways, plenty of limes hanging out down here. There's a few limes going on here, like I've talked about before. That's a big one for a lime right there. I'm going to pick that one too. And then the lemon is actually has some that are starting to turn a little bit. But really, that's it. Not a lot of uh, interesting stuff. Just uh, cooler weather and, uh, oh, be sad tomato plants. I mean, I transplanted them. They survived the transplant, but they're not growing. It's just too cold. And these plants said, heck no. Um, let's end it on the, uh, oh, we'll end it on these two uh, figs. So, transplanted them. These leaves went, leaves went almost all white. But, well, there's two things going on here. One, this is a donor potato plant. Those are the only, so we got, what, three new leaves? And the same with this one. It's got like three new leaves on there. So it survived a transplant. It survived the heat. And uh, we'll just see how it grows going forward. And this silly tomato. We'll end with the tomato. There's a couple of blossoms, even after I chopped this thing all the way down. But I doubt that it's actually going to grow a tomato before uh, before it gets cold. But we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching.